YouTube. I've got the vegan revolution. If you're tuning in, I the will vegan. get his mask off before the end. So <laughs> stay tuned for that. Yeah, there we go. It's starting. I started no, now. No, I might have included that bit because there's a delay. It's, yeah, we'll just keep it free It's flowing. worth confusing. Yeah, so I'm with the vegan revolution. He's staying around my house. So that's pretty cool. Vegan crew in the house. We don't really know what we're going to talk about, though, do we? It's a big delay. It's well confusing. So we're, we're watching that. Like and that's like ten seconds. That's behind. how many people are watching. So nobody's watching. <laughs> nobody's watching, but it's gonna get uploaded anyway. So it's yeah. Still good. So I can see my I can see myself talking from like twenty seconds ago, which is kind of weird. It's really confusing. It's cool though, man. Like I never, I, I'm considering doing it myself now, and I never would have thought that. That's the future. Yeah. Never would have thought to do that. <laughs> um, <laughs> no figures come up. Do we, how long do we leave it before we just give up and go? And go, yeah, Couple let's just minutes. go to bed. Check out the, <laughs> check out the t-shirts, though. We're rocking the bros. Yeah, I bought them, like, the I, was, I bought um, these as soon as Tim Shee started to sell them a couple of weeks ago. And they got, they were, like, sold out within, like, an hour and a half, Millie said. Najeev. It's a great idea. Sounds um, tribal, doesn't it? What tribe. what do you think of the idea of doing it backwards? Like, is it too covert for you? Because you're quite a, you're very out there militant, um, vegan, 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 vegan. Is it like too subliminal for you? Or? Yeah, man. I think I can see why he's done it. There's like a no one's watching. <laughs> <laughs> it will be uploaded, though. It will be uploaded. Yeah. Let's talk about the Nanji thing. I think this is a conversation I've been having today. It's like some people don't want to watch Earthlings. Like, some people don't want to wear a t-shirt that says vegan on it. And I think everyone should. That's interesting. I know what you mean. The Earthlings thing, if people don't want to watch that, that's that's fine as long as they are vegan. Um, no, but I think it gets you into a mindset where it makes it more important for you. I think it makes them vegan, but if they're not... it will, Maybe some people just can't handle it. But I just think, like, to become a proper vegan activist, you need to know what it is you're up against. So... Yeah, but awesome. what about people that aren't vegan activists? People, because most people they're not like me and you. Like my sister's, um, she's got mates that are vegan, but they don't know about this community. They don't know about the activism. I think they should. I think like being vegans, the the standard. Hey, we got someone watching. Hello, whoever that is. Oh, I'd love to know. Comment. Who is it? We want to know. We've got one view. <laughs> <laughs> There's more people producing this. It, they're gonna go off audience. in a sec. I'm waiting for it. Oh, they're still there. Still there. Feel free to write in the question chat box. Yeah, we we're just questions. talking about this T-shirt. I think it's genius. Like, I think it. I think. Do you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Christianity, where it stopped being the cross and it became the fish symbol, and that was under the Roman Empire because of tyranny. And I think so we have to be like okay, not be honest. Oh, we got that's at least two. Nah, look, it says one still. Nah. It's, it's deceptive. Oh, Hi Las, Las Vegas. Vegas. Andrea Reed. What yeah, time we... is it in Las Vegas? Like midday ish? Probably someone on their lunch break. Wherever. Yeah. Yeah, we've got Yorkshire, we've got Las Vegas. Bromley Vegan, I'm guessing that's uh, Birmingham then. Assuming you didn't move away. Yeah, if anybody's in um, London this weekend, let us know. It'd be cool to meet up. We're going to go to VegFest. Um, Covertly. Are we gonna announce so, it no, here? No, 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 no. I was gonna, I was gonna. Uh, <laughs> no, you go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Two eighteen p.m. Now. Greetings. This is Alan. Everyone's here. Everyone, man. Yeah, California here. So basically, if there's any questions, I don't know if. Oh, raw expression, mate. I love your music. Um, <laughs> y'all in Cali, yo. Oh, mate. Like I've listened to your track like a good ten to fifteen times. Um, j just write a comment to confirm it's you, but I'm pretty sure it is. You're from California, and you did a wicked track, but you said you put up more tracks, and you haven't yet. Where are you, boy? He's not going to write anything now. No, it's still there. It's just a bit of a delay. You can't be covert. And put you can, actually. We figured out a way to do it. You'll see. <laughs> ah, no, I'm not going to take it off. I'll take it off in a minute. Oh, that's cool. You know everyone, man. Mate, you've heard it. You've heard Raw Expression. Who's that? Mate, I can't believe... Okay, um... Give me a clue. Maybe I have. Basically, he's like a... He's probably yeah, in his I'm early fine. 20s. Um, he's from California. Hey, Vegan Jay. Hey, what's going hey, on, everybody. man? Hey, everybody. 
Raw expression, yeah. He's from California. He's like early twenties, and he's a lad. He's a proper lad. He's um, yeah. I'll get it up to remind you. Yeah, go you. on. It'll work on. But that. like he said, I messaged him about it. He said he was gonna um get other people to help him and take it to the next level. I haven't seen a video <laughs> from him in ages, but like, I loved I loved your first track, man. We got multi Smarland, multi Smarland. Yeah, hey man. Hi, I'm your one viewer. You're not, man. Hell yeah, man, that's what's up. I've been working on a mixtape and video concept ideas. That's it, New yeah. New stuff, man. Get excited. Yeah, We're yeah, going to get you up. We're going to promote you right mate, now. Mate, I've got your channel. Um, one video, as I said. It's, just one but it's, awesome it's gold. Video. Anybody listening to this, Boobs on the thumbnail. check out Raw Expression. There. But it's on the basis, yeah, that you do more. Not None of this, like, I've been working, getting mixtape. I'm going to take a year or two. Get the content out, <laughs> man. You're genius. There you go, you've been told. Shall I, uh, do you want me to play it? Yeah, yeah, get up. <laughs> Turn it off a bit, where's the door? I can't, mate, I can't. Probably get Seattle. Is it vegan? Yeah, yeah. Oh, bitch, you thirsty because of the drought? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's nice, man. I appreciate what you're doing there. Basically, it was a brilliant way to create awareness. You just, you yeah. rapped like a G for 2 minutes 45 seconds, dropping the truth bombs and everybody listening. It's got over 2,000 views. Quite a lot First of, video, man. Quite a lot of dislikes, which is a good thing because it shows us getting out to the mainstream. Yeah, that's pissing people um, off. That's what it's all about. Like, yeah, if you ever need, like, a shout-out or anything from my channel, I'm Plant-Based News, but if you ever need a shout-out, let me know. Like, I think I promoted one of your videos before. I love it, so keep it. Keep doing it. I'll tell you what, let's ask all you questions. Who should we be watching on YouTube? And first off, like, shout out to Klaus, uh, Plant Based News, really useful channel because he's talking about, like, um, what's relevant and, like, the, the progression in the, the vegan movement, basically. Um, Just I like got, any of a celebrity goes vegan or something like that, I'll, I'll, I, I find it really interesting. No, so all of it, like, the stuff. science, you do all of it. Um, greetings from Wales. Is it Brecon in Wales? Hi guys, your toast mate. Greetings from uh, Welsh Valleys. Love you. Welsh Can you Valleys. do a Welsh accent? Oh, lovely leather jacket. That nah, was that's like, not good, is it? It's not good. That was like up there with like the Shrek accent. All right, mate. <laughs> At the end of the day, you haven't even tried. So, what's your Welsh accent saying? Oh, hi guys, your toast to me. <laughs> <laughs> greetings from Welsh Valleys. Vegan love. <laughs> Brummy Vegan, how will we support Vegan Revolution if you're at VegFest on Sunday, if you're going covert? Klaus going in the val val club and you going in your real place. <laughs> that would be epic. Um, yeah, let's just say there's going to be... We've got a, a method. We've got a method. We're going to mix it up every time and for this one. Yeah, you're going to have to be there to see it, though. Yeah. So see you at VegFest if you're coming. Where can I get one of those Naj Najeev shirts? Ethicsandantics.com, but go. they're going to sell out in about an hour or two because Tim Sheaf, who runs that website with Millie, yeah, he's and just John is housemate, he's just an another shout out. So every time he does that, it sells out really, really quick. But this is a large, I'm like six foot one. Tim yeah. Sheaf's like five, eight or nine. He said he's, he rocks mm -hmm. a medium pretty well. But mm -hmm. oh, yeah, we're just talking about it, actually. I think it's a great idea. Um, obviously, vegan backwards, I think. I think it's good because the open mind, the people that would go vegan are the ones that will like look at it and think, oh, what does that mean? Do you know what I mean? It's yeah. for the open minded people. So. But you know what's quite nice about it is as much as people have got to read it to like take in vegan, with this they have to like do a puzzle first and then when they figure it out, it's like their fault for being offended. Because it's like, yeah, you, it's not in their face. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But, um. Milanta Winterwood. No, I'm trying to. Mate, I, I'm not going to try and up a Welsh accent. What about Bromley? Mm, nah, <laughs> I'm not, not going to go that, there. That's a gonna, nah. You proper shit. Thesis Allen. From. The... <laughs> we got some crew. We got some. We got 12 what? watching. Yeah. That's like that's, um, that's a football team. <laughs> that was like my first video. That was like 12 views, I think. Is it? See, that's the thing. That guy's put out his first video. That's reaching people. 2,000. I wish expression. I'd known about that, man. I would have shared that everywhere. Shout out to the other um, vegan people doing music stuff as well. Um, obviously, Kerry McCarpet. I'm trying to think of the others. Oh, gosh. I did a video on it. I just can't remember the names. Moby. Like... <laughs> Morrissey. Yeah. Shout out to Morrissey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking less mainstream than that. There have been some good ones the last few months. Um, 
Russell Simmons. <laughs> <laughs> Big names. Yeah. Yeah, we could do with like um, was it Chikules or whatever it was? I've shown you that one. The guy who's on the farm sanctuary doing a rap. That was pretty Which sweet. Which one man. is it? I'm trying to remember. Yeah. What I might do, I might do like a video, like top 10 vegan tracks for 2015 at the end of the year. I think that would be quite fun. Yeah, do it. Yeah, Dead Prez. Who else is like good tracks? Dead Prez, everyone knows that one. You know that one? Yeah, yeah. What's like Moby? Like, what are people like? We need more vegan now? music, I think. Yeah, I reckon. It's like somebody did a, a video for my channel called like Vegan Art, and they were just exploring how. A lot of people come into veganism for the health side of it. A lot of people are into like creating environmental awareness, um, obviously for the animals and stuff like that. But nobody's really talking about it from an artist perspective. Like I feel what like. What would that be like? Well, you could do some like what Banksy did with the with the dolphin. Coming yeah, out Banksy's of the toilet. a classic like, example. That's, like, that's just yeah. a really potent, like, creative, powerful way of spreading. Do you the know, message, there's a I woman think. who did um. Uh, an arts exhibition oh JME yeah that's a good shout Pulse 8 yeah he does a little, there's a few vegan lyrics oh, another one is um, Diane's word with Yolandi she's got a few lines where she's like that tastes nice because don't eat meat <laughs> they're great man if you know Diane Wood who else we got in here Jake Eames get Pal Simmons to write and produce a rap album about veganism Pal could do a bit of music or yeah, has he possibly. already done a bit I don't know there's there's a podcast that I never released where Pal Simeon yeah, and yeah. I had a rap battle. We never put it out, but it was good stuff. VR, are you living with Klaus now? Sort of. What am I doing? Um, I'm here for the meantime. Yeah, At least well, we don't even rest. know what the situation is. Yeah. He was going to move in, but then turns out we don't have a spare room. So he's, <laughs> he's staying in my room. Um, yeah. Which is obviously not a permanent thing, but like just yeah. stay till he's getting a uh, new job. So I guess I'm just yeah, trying just to help him. Yeah, just starting as a cy cycling courier. Yeah. So sort of. um, oh let's okay. So we've actually got some questions. So let's not ignore anything. Uh, so we told you where you can get the Najib T-shirts. I'll just come to your house and steal yours. Then I guess. Um, go for it. Just uh, you, uh, I like these. I want to keep Mate, them. I love him. Massive yeah. advocate of this. I think it's thing. good graphics the design as well. Wicked. For the, the slammer. The, just the sound of the word backwards. Slammer. It's, it's like stamina. Yeah, yeah exactly. But it's it's like, animals. It's brilliant. Um, you'll notice that the title for this as well is Najev Evil. That's live vegan. It should be live vegans. Snajev. Snajev sounds like a, it's too, a synonym for Yeah, this. it's too Pussy. foreign for people. Like people oh. won't know. <laughs> So, am I living with Klaus now? Not really. I'm here for the... Now I am. But, like... Yeah. Any advice on turning people vegan? Go. Have you turned uh, anyone vegan? Yeah. Um, I've turned... Well, this guy had heart disease. I don't know if that... Is that veganism? Oh, that if somebody cuts out animal products for their heart disease? I would say it is. Yeah, because you're there for them when they, they're looking. Yeah, That's one so thing, is just being there for people. Most people won't do it by themselves. But if you're just there to support them at that moment where they're thinking about it... That's huge, just being there for... Um... Yeah, we go, he had heart disease now, he's dropped like five stone, um, his, his name's Phil, absolute legend. Go walking with him around the park once a week normally. Um, but apart from that, yeah, another guy, I, I wouldn't say I've turned people vegan, but the beauty of like... You facilitated two, it. I facilitated that, because the thing of 2015 is, you don't even have to do it, you just got to know a few resources, like Earthlings, Garyovsky video, just send those two to people, and that will change a lot of people's lives you yeah. don't even have to do the hard work yeah pl um plant-based athlete um he started saying like just take yourself out of the equation just send them to the people who inspired you to be vegan yeah like don't fuck about going oh i'll tell you all this just be like here's a video yeah exactly. remove yourself from the process so that's quite good advice um i just wanted to say thank you for the awesome content and spreading the vegan message keep up the good work thank you valo falconry um we will by the way he's got a um Check out below this. He'll put his, is that my phone? Yeah. He'll put his um, WhatsApp number. If you got any questions about like, oh me, is that alright? I say this here, yeah. Yeah, I don't actually know it off by heart. We'll put it below. I'm also on um, Ask FM as uh, the Vegan Guru, the Vegan Revolution on that. It's satirical that I've called myself the Vegan Guru. 
Any advice on turning people vegan? We've done that. Um, I've got some vegan beatboxing for you want. Ha, 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 ha. Bertie Justice, the waking up process. Yeah, man. I'm all up for beatboxing. Beatboxing is fucking awesome. Can you beatbox? Can I drop a beat? Can you? Ah, no, I can't. Have... That was a surprise. <laughs> Nah, I've lost it, mate. <laughs> now you got to go to the beat. No, I'm not doing it. you got to do it. you got to do it at the same time. <laughs> let's, let's keep going. Yeah, let's, let's, let's keep um, going with the questions. Get past him. Yeah, we'll, we'll tell, we'll tell past him about that. I've lost my place. Well, hold on, mate. I saw a really just, interesting I'm one, just, but I might have skipped a few it people. It skips a lot on this. Um, this is the second attempt to doing this, so like they'll keep getting more professional as we go. Have we got the lighting sorted? Yeah, it's all right. It's, it's a bit right. shady. Do the job. Yeah. Hold on. Um, get power sooner. We will. Jamie Pulsate is a good track. Right, I'm about to start uploading songs I've written that are meant to be from oppressed animals' point of view. That's from vegan vocals. Oh, cool, man. That, your name suddenly makes more sense. All right, cool. And um. Good, the lighting. Yeah, go for it, vegan vocals. Send me that when you do it, and I'll help promote that. Assuming it's awesome, I'm sure it will be. Vinny B, Pulse A makes you want to punch a meatard. <laughs> do you know who else is really good? Uh, Goldfinger, really into their tunes for like that kind of scar, scar vegan um, anarchist sort of skater boy music. Art RT for why did uh, raw till for vegan. <laughs> Question, are you guys on Periscope as well? I don't know where Klaus has gone. He's run off. Um, I haven't figured that out yet. Like I said, we've just started doing these. So that's news to me. Brummy Vegan. Brummy Vegan. Vegan Mental Health is a great new channel. No, I can't do it. Vegan Mental Health is a great new channel. She's experimented producing some quality informative content. Oh, yeah, if anyone's got any shout-outs for YouTube channels, I'm very aware of Vegan Mental Health. Uh, I've actually done a podcast with her in it, so... Uh, yeah, cheers, man. Rummy Vegan, Klaus, put him in the greenhouse. <laughs> yeah, I should just live in the greenhouse. Brum Someone said live in the greenhouse. <laughs> should we do in the greenhouse? Can no, no, I should live in the greenhouse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Brummy Vegan, spare room sorted. Jane, Jake Eames. Hey, it is Eames, isn't it? I remember, yeah. Uh, Brummy Vegan, I've been watching her channel for a little while. I saw you comment on her most recent video. So everyone's in on that. That's you coming in. Um, Vieli, would you be okay with taking a pig's heart to continue loved one's life? Too confusing and too hypothetical for me. Do you know what? There was a TV series when I was a kid growing up called Pig Heart Boy. And it was all about a boy who went through the tra trauma of being like the first kid to have a pig heart as a replacement for his. Controversial. And, um, check out Pig Heart Boy for like a really insightful like what that would involve. And I remember there was an episode where some animal rights protesters just suddenly found him on his way to school and chucked blood over him, and he was just wow. really upset. See, I heard of that, but I never made the link as a vegan to animal rights. And okay, yeah, yeah. So this is news to me. It's really interesting, isn't it? I'll check. Thanks for that reminder, though. I'll check out Pig Heart Boy again. Um, your loved one's life. What if my loved one is a pig? Mate, it's a great comment. No, have you read this one? No shirts are good for biking on the road because drivers would read vegan in their rear view mirror. Great point. That's good. Get like big um, stickers for your car as well, innit? On hey, the front, man. Ambulance on, style. Oh, I said to Grant we go for a cycle on Saturday, but we can't. But next time we go for a cycle, we'll definitely. Rocking these. Yeah. Um, who do we skip then? This is Alan. Can we discuss the important issues like who's the hottest vegans on YouTube? Sorcia Freely, Asina. VR's forehead. Mate, Vegan Revolution's forehead pain. is beautifully shiny. It's, it's this amazing. This is a bad setup. Um, banana Blondie is the... <laughs> uh, banana Blondie is the hottest. Uh, she, she's my favourite. Um, she's a mum though, so it's a bit. Yummy mummy. Yoga mum. Vegan yoga mum. With attitude. With, with attitude. What's not to love. Um, hello from New York City. Oh, I've lost my hello, place mate. You did this every time in the last video. It's because this ma the trackpad shit. Um, those shirts are good for biking on the road. Oh yeah, I yeah. Like that, yeah. Uh, Betas. New York City. Beta as, beta as, oh. beta as. 
Hello from New York City. Hello from um, Hi, Michael Weinstein land, isn't it? From South London. Oh, is that him? That's yeah, why right. he's moved to Hawaii now. But oh, okay, yeah, that's what I thought. I'm a science fiction academic, and I'm working on some articles on veganism, animal rights issues in novels and films, like, like Blade, Blade Runner. Do you think that would have an effect on people? Yes, it would. There was a news article about Definitely. a month or two ago where a publisher has just gone vegan, and they're looking for people like you to write oh, I didn't in. Oh, know that. Cool. Um, I can't remember the exact name of it. If you email me or whatever, I'll sync you up with them. Everyone um, check out his channel, Plant Based News. I've sort of like hijacked his channel recently, so uh, it's the most viewed video, and it's pretty it? hilarious. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I've watched it a cool. good ten to twenty I've times, it at and least 30. it it Just editing it, it. Do, it doesn't get old. Is that arrogant for me to say? No, it doesn't. Really. Yeah. So it's fucking awesome. <laughs> but yeah, check out his channel. At least like if you don't, if you're not aware of Klaus' channel, Plant Based News. It's essential part of the community, like more than like eight. another what I eat in a day sort of thing. Like no one else is really doing what he's doing. Jane Unchained, Jane Velez Mitchell, check her out. As Even well. then, she's like journal- journalistic, sort of on the road sort of thing. Like you're more just kind of like here's the here's the breakdown. So you know, unique voice in the community. Um, okay. The uh, yeah, write your book. I just want to add to that. It's like storytelling like one of the reasons I was such a convicted uh, or a vegetarian with a lot of conviction just as a kid is because of like stuff like animals are farthing wood and like think about how many people babe turned uh, vegetarian even the actor in it I forgot his name now do you know that guy like James Cromwell or something that's not his name to be honest I kind of switched off from <laughs> sorry <laughs> too honest uh. we've got 20 watching now Wicked. What's that like? That's like a, that's like um, it's like a classroom, isn't it? It's like a public school classroom where they've kept the numbers low just to just improve. so you don't faint. It's not five to a classroom. Was it chaos? Yeah, man. Um, so yeah, stories are re- stories are possibly the best way of doing this, I think. Um, and also, there are a lot of environmental tales um, that have been written in the last hundred years that are like, and the farmer went out into the land, and then he killed a pig, and then from that moment, he was at one with nature. And you know what I mean? They need to be rewritten with a bit more of a vegan narrative, if that makes sense. Oh, so it's even like the news, when it tells a story, is telling it from a point of view that might be trying to manipulate people to be like, sympathise Facilitate the brainwashing. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Um, so someone's put the trifecta. Earthlings, Forks Over Knives, Cowspiracy. Full trifecta, bro. Yeah, the three. <laughs> Full trifecta. Earth, you know what? Uh, like, with Earthlings, yeah? Like, I'm not I'm not going against veganism here, but just, just hear me out. Like, All right. um, I'm not critical of it, but I'm wary of it because I don't feel what's in that reflects the current practices in animal agriculture but there's the thing it's always changing so much they're like that came out 2005 yeah so all the footage would have been from the 90s and early noughties and it was yeah it was made before that so it is actually out of practice and then people use that against vegans where they're like oh that, we don't dehorn them like that anymore yeah but i mean 99 percent of it's still just or whatever it's still very similar um the universal point isn't the methods it's the fact that we just shouldn't we shouldn't... Uh, I mean, speciesism is the yeah, main yeah, yeah, yeah. value of it. So it doesn't really matter how we're doing it to animals. I'm not trying to discredit it. I'm just saying... I think I sent it to one of my friends and they... If, the, if he you just can't said send it, it very, to a farmer... Yeah, he just said it was very sensationalist and then sent me another video back of animal agriculture. To be fair, it is propaganda, but we need propaganda on this side to balance out all the fucking TV adverts and brainwashing and billboards. Neutral would just not... You yeah, need the yeah. other side of the seesaw, Cowspiracy I spot on in every way, I think. Um, I think you're like, he's the editing king. I think even if he had all the raw footage, he wouldn't have been able to do a better job than... Um, Cowspiracy is like a well-told it's story. the music, yeah. the, everything. Yeah. Brilliant. I need to watch it again, actually. I've only watched... Uncle Dreamer 7 is a great channel, VR, you'd love her. She's done videos on shrooms. Out to me like... Oh, if you've got any advice, because I don't know how to handle it. And then uh, got her on... Aware of Logical Dreamer 7. Oh, I fucked up. What do you call that? That is correct. 
I didn't know. You, does that mean it's a Jakey from the US? I'm pretty sure they say. I Barry think he's Barbara a Kiwi. Kiwi. We know some Kiwis in London. Yeah, man. Kiwis make me happy. I love yeah, the Yeah, we got some good grub. Oh. Shout out to Jake Eames as well. He's. Um, I don't know how long your channel's been running, but I only discovered it quite recently. Yeah, maybe me too. like a month ago, and um, or less than that even. I'm really enjoying your stuff. You like the way you're telling it. We got somebody from and your accent as well, Crew great. or she, but um, yeah, I don't. Yeah. Oh right, you're reading the next one. I'm I, I want to yeah. know what you're saying. Yeah. My boss became almost vegan after a visit in Peru. He was doing ayahuasca, and I had told him to don't animals. Only chickens are allowed. Ha. Huh. Ooh. YouTube is not receiving enough video to make smooth streaming as such. Years will experience buffering. All right. Nah. Move around less, and then it won't have to compress as much. Yeah. Go go static like predators watching you. Um, yeah, ayahuasca. Like do, people do have experiences on um, drugs. Although I know one guy, a uh, mate who. Um, Like it. It's a good I like attitude. It. I like that. How do you tell your friends and family you want to go vegan when you don't know how to react? Um, how why you all react? Just do it. Um, That's from Megloss. We spoke Meg to somebody Loss. on the weekend that um, only was able to go vegan after going to university, so they needed that real crossroad in their life in order yeah. to make the change. So maybe Shout think about changing your job or your lifestyle or something else and it'll make the transition to a little bit easier do they have someone who just gives them shit for becoming well, they might have friends that really judge them and they actually need to move away from those friends or at least learn to stand up for themselves a bit first yeah so just be, like it's all kind of like understanding their situation a bit more but i always think like the first thing to do is like get them to want to be vegan and then I make sure they're clear what their motivation towards it is because yeah. most people become vegan they're not really sure why they've done it Yeah, they're just like oh I suppose I'll give this a go um, so yeah just give them that clarity oh it's dropped off a bit <laughs> it's, it's, uh, well, we'll get to the end of this um, the buffering issue probably the buffering killed it maybe uh, so there you go Megalos Bertie Justice the waking up process it's a Tetrix remix all right, we'll look at that afterwards. Cheers, man. But if Klaus Vier and Pal Simeon made a rap group, they could be called the Trifecta Bros. I've already got a name for my individual one. I'm going to be called B12, like D12, the group that... I've got some raps on their way. I've, they've... He's got a really cool Baddy accent. Um... Sorsha's a real... Life like, if you know how her face moves... Like every word has an emotion that comes with it, and it's quite. She's really powerful to like. You know those YouTube channels that have like twenty billion subscribers, and they're all about celebrity gossip kind of stuff. They like she's similar to them, but it's about veganism. Like in, yeah. in the way this, the way she talks, smart, I reckon, she like, really yeah. gets people to engage with what she's she saying. She knows how she's coming across. Uh, I say that mainly because she's around my age. <laughs> Yeah, she's like, what is she, 18, 19? She's a, she's a wise old soul, though. Um, Jake Eames, hello, Mr. Vegan J. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Brommy Vegan, Joey Carbstrong. Check him out, his Rapeless Mondays video is awesome. He actually mentioned me in that video, so I'm aware of that, we're tight. Uh, ALF documentary on YouTube, have you watched it? Yeah, uh, Behind the Mask. What is it about? Um, it's about like the really hardcore vegan scene, people breaking into labs, like uh, people getting killed in doing it as well. It's, um, yeah. The part with Britches the monkey will break your heart. It might be a different one we've watched, unless I don't remember that bit. The Vegan Tricks waves, the, that plant-based news takeover will never get old. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll be through these. Uh, oh, fuck. He... No. he just saw a mum just doing that because he just fucked up again. <laughs> <laughs> Jake um, Eames. Um, Trix is also here. Quite a few people I watch. Yeah, man. She's really putting out the footage. She's set herself a challenge of one a day. 
Behind the Mask, is that the documentary, Valo Falconer? Yep. Uh, all right, Jake. Everyone's talking to each other now. Van I Gel Zen. I'm an illustrator and want to do more vegan activism with this. Do you have any ideas or suggestions? Get in touch with uh, what's her name? She did a video on my channel a few days ago. It's all about vegan art and the people that are doing it. Obviously, at the top of that is Banksy. Oh, Hannah Chloe. No, not Hannah Chloe. Oh, what's, um, what's that girl? Oh, oh, I feel okay. awful. I feel awful. I've just completely forgotten her name. Get in touch with her. I said Hannah Chloe because that's sort of throwing me off as well. Yeah. Should we get oh, that up? Oh, gosh. We, you read the next one and I'll find her. Hey, Vegan Revolution. From Vegan Revolution. Hey. Nah, it's plant based news. Um, <laughs> on, I don't know how to scroll down. Veg Educated is the most underrated vegan documentary. I haven't watched Vegucated's it. Veg Educated's great because what it does is it uses like um, voyeurism. So you watch other people go on the journey. Any uh, chance of you or footage of you playing saxophone? Um, I don't have my saxophone back yet. It's at my grand's house. Here we are. I got it. I got it. Um, is anyone else lagging? Yeah, sorry. Is that's the situation? Hey, Percy Vegan, how's it going? Oh, we've gone to yellow, red to yellow. I hope that's better. <laughs> it's usually how it works, isn't it? Uh, Vegucated is really good. It's not so professionally made, but it doesn't need to be because it's kind of like fly on the wall documentary following a group of people. They basically go like, "We're gonna have a bit of time with you." They get a group of people who aren't vegan and go, "If the following things will turn you vegan," they show them the documentaries. They teach them to cook. They get them to eat vegan. All encapsulated into yeah, like one or two hours. No, no, like over like a couple of weeks. Oh, so it's like a little course or something. Yeah, and by the end of it, the people are just really like, just it gets quite emotional. People Life are like, changing. oh, I didn't want to learn this yet. It's, I wasn't ready for it. And it's, um, it's, they did a year's catch up with them. You can check that out up on YouTube. And um, some of them weren't vegan anymore. Quite a few of them have gone to vegetarian as like a middle gap. So it just shows you can't. Well, what it shows is if you push people into veganism, then they'll become vegetarian. If the, if it had been all about pushing them to vegetarian, they probably would have slipped back to meat, I reckon. So that's why we should always um, promote the end goal. Any chance of you playing? So, uh, anyone else lagging? I'm lagging bad. Yeah, loads getting laggy. I'm lagging too. Have you ever read the book A Million Little Pieces? No. Tell us about it. I YouTube. Feel like well, so I, I reckon I've been with a girl who owned a copy of that and she was reading a lot while I was hanging out with her. I can't remember what it's about though, so Percy Vegan, let let's know. YouTube Valo's yeah. is running low on carbs, keeps lagging behind. Sorry about that. I thought my oh, internet YouTube. was decent. You've got good internet. Let's just check on the thing. Is it? Yeah, it looks... I don't know what that's about. It must be because there's two of us. It's... Uh, nice you rock guys, you. thank you. Are you going to the London Veg Fest this weekend? Yeah, we are. Um, we're see you gonna there. Make an interesting appearance. I'm not going to elaborate on that, but we'll see you there. Yeah. YouTube is on a keto diet. I'm sorry about that. Right, we're going to end the questions and then we'll um, we'll wrap it up. We're, I'm not going to do a massive one. I don't know how long we've been. Oh, 34 minutes. Yeah, well, uh, you guys rock. See you at Veg Fest. Nicole is also here. Uh, question for Klaus. Yes, lagging. Yeah, she's super sarcastic and funny too. She's engaging. Yeah, source is great. YouTube is on a keto diet. Yeah, full glucio neogenesis going on here. Uh, what will you be talking about at Vegan Futures? I'm not giving a talk. You're not. Actually, because you're in the promo for it, so it looks like you're a big part of it. <laughs> you're just like giving it a shout out, basically. I don't know why you put me <laughs> in the thing in the in the promo. No, it's good to see you in there. Got yeah. Um, what will you be talking about Vegan Futures? Um, neither of us are going to... Uh, we'll probably be there, but like, you'll go to it, right? Oh, definitely. Yeah, good. Yeah. Without doubt. From a vegan, Emma Blackberry. She's al almost vegan, has mentioned her things in her vlog. to do with pushing the message to her 1 million subscribers. All right. All right I'm going to make a note of that. Yeah, there's a pencil. Yeah, I'd try on that book. Cool. Right. Check out this book I got. <laughs> Standard. Oh, it takes a while for it to come up there. I'll assume you can read that. The Vegan's Guide to People Arguing with Vegans. Y useful. But they missed out a lot of tips, I reckon. Um, it's about drug addiction. Oh, okay. I've definitely heard of that. 
Um, thanks for the Emma Blackberry thing. The Royal Chocolate Company, dark chocolate, chocolate, dark chocolate, goji berries and orange. Best chocolate ever. That does sound fucking good. Not lagging anymore. Yay. I want to ask a question. You have to get in there quick because we're about in this. Yeah, man, that's what I thought. Sorry, the lag is really bad, but I really recommend it. Kind of opened my eyes a little bit. And if you can be, read a snippet there. Do that's they mean it. That book? Oh, I don't know. Um, quick, read a paragraph. This guy doesn't seek to turn the world vegan, even if it would make it a better place. It explores the interactions of people who make different choices about what they eat at dinner time. Be they morally compelled, economically constrained, or compromised by taste. Around the nation's broad dining table, we can find blah, 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 blah. Cannibalism kind of... It's written in a like kind of weird way, isn't it? I'm the vegan revolution in Klaus's house. Peace. Oh, wait, I've got to do a whole... I've got to do a series of shortcuts now. Bye. That was Sorry cool. you didn't get to answer your question, oh. that person. Bedtime. Done. I'm going to bed. Boom. Night. Boom.